Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, my name is Krista and I am so excited that you are here. Today's video is this glitter liner natural cut crease tutorial. I did pull out one of my favorite palettes for this look, the Desi Katie Dose of Colors Friendcation palette. Love this palette. And I also use the Sephora glitter pots for the eyeliner and I think it turned out so good. So if you'd like to see how I get this look, then just keep watching. Okay guys, we are starting with our eyes. The first thing I'm gonna do is prime my lids. I'm gonna be using my concealer, the Too Faced Born This Way Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer in the shade Almond. And I'm just gonna put that all over my lids. And then I'm gonna blend it out with a beauty blender. For my eyeshadows today, I'm using the Dose of Colors Friendcation Palette, collaboration with Desi Katie. And then I'm gonna go ahead and set my lid with the Morphe M532 and Basic. Now that our lids are set, I'm gonna go in with my transition shade. I'm gonna be using a Morphe M504 and Necessary. And I'm gonna buff that into my crease. Then I just wanna deepen up the crease a little bit. I'm gonna be going in with the Luxie 213 Eye Shading Brush and the shade Cheens. And I'm just gonna put that right in the socket. And then I'm just gonna take a little bit of that Necessary shade and blend that out. So when you have something like this, I am gonna go in with some concealer and cut the crease. And I'm gonna bring the cut crease all the way out. Now I'm gonna go ahead and set that with some translucent powder. I want this to stay as white as possible. So now I'm gonna go ahead and even this up a little bit. I'm taking an E18 and that same Cheens shade, and I'm going to put that along the cut crease. So now we're gonna move on to the glitter liner. The first thing I'm gonna do is put down a base for the glitter to stick to. I'm using the NYX Glitter Primer. And then for the glitter, I'm gonna be using the Pink Sephora Glitter Pot. And I'm going to be using these two brushes. This is a BH Cosmetics eyeliner brush and a Sigma E65. Now with a Morphe M433, I'm gonna go into Girl By just a little bit. And I just wanna add like a little bit of a pinky red to the crease. Blend. So we got a little something like that. Ooh, I like it. Different. Kinda wanna put something on the lid. I'm just gonna take a small pencil brush. This is an R41 and the blush I'm about to use. This is the Kylie Jenner Pressed Blush Powder in Virginity. Just adding a little bit of pink to the lid. All right, we got a little something like that. Very pretty. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my face so we can do the lower lash line. Okay, so this is what we are looking like with the rest of our face on. I am digging this look. I did highlight my brow bone and inner corner with a little bit of Jeffree Star Sarcophagus. Same that I used as my highlight. So now I'm gonna go in with my lower lash line. The first thing that I'm going to do is take my BH Cosmetics Small Crease Brush and that Necessary Shade, and I'm gonna buff that under my lower lash line. Then with a Luxie 141 Mini Round, I'm gonna go in with the Girl By shade and I'm gonna blend that right up against my lower lash line. And then I'm gonna go back in with the BH Cosmetics brush. Just make sure that's blended. 
So now I am going to line my waterline with a pink lip liner. I don't suggest this, but if you want to do it, do it at your own risk. I am going to be using the NYX lip liner in Peekaboo Neutral, and it is the same thing I'm going to line my lips with later. Okay, now I'm just gonna throw on some mascara and I'm using some very light lashes today. These are the Christina Demi Wispies. I get these off of Amazon. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that and we will be right back for the lips. All right, lashes and mascara is on. I'm gonna go ahead and move on to lips. I'm using that same lip liner I used in my waterline, the NYX lip liner in Peekaboo Neutral. And I'm going to line my lips with this, and I'm also going to fill it in. And then for lipstick, I'm going to be using this NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick in Tea and Cookies. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I think it turned out so pretty. I honestly was going to give up halfway through the crease. I'm not very good at cut creases, but it turned out really cute. And I love the pink liner. I think it gives it like a little something without being too much. I'm really glad I added a little bit of pink to the lid. I think it kind of like ties everything together. And I think it is such a fun look for Valentine's Day. Especially if you just want to have a little bit of fun on Valentine's Day. I think this is such a cool look to do. And it really wasn't that difficult either. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I hope you guys have a great day or night wherever you are. Toddy bye.